Okay, so we have got a Future Stars reunion player pick. Let's open a load of these up and let's see what we can get. Do you guys want to kickstart your Foot 22 team off with a bang? Head over to MoveFactory.com for the cheapest, most safe and reliable coins and use the code NERDFIRE at the checkout for 5% off your order and get yourself some Foot coins to boost your team right now. Okay, boys, so today we are back with a brand new video and as you can tell by the title, a brand new player pick is here again that was not leaked once again and is pretty sick. So it's a Future Stars reunion player pick. Basically, it requires an 85 rated squad, two informs, and it can be any player that had a Future Stars in previous FIFAs that has a special card in this FIFA that you can basically get in the player pick. So for example, it's basically like Sancho's ones to watch. You've got Jonathan David's team of the year moments, uh, Vinicius Jr's headliners, like there's some very good players you can get here. And today we've opened up about 10 of them. We're revealing as well. We've revealed them in this video. And most of them anyways, instead of just straight up opening them, which I think is like, it goes too quick, especially for the people that are spending literally an 85 rated squad and two team of the weeks like it just has to be revealed in my opinion anyways so let's get into these play picks that's what you guys are here for if you guys have opened them up let me know in the comments below what you managed to get anyways let's do it and i'll see you guys after okay here we go we got the future stars reunion play pick you can do this twice i believe per account and we're about to send the first one on my account it's an 85 rate with two team in a week so it's not the cheapest but we'll see what we can get i'm going to submit it now let's get into our first one and let's see what we get all right, so here it is. I'm actually still very confused of what you can actually get back from this player pick. I'm not fully sure yet. This is the first one, obviously, we're opening up. So let's just, I guess, go through it and see what we get in the first one, reveal it, and then we'll probably open up the rest of them normally. All right, so the pick is here. Let's get the image in front, Mr. Sancho. Just give me a once to watch Sancho, and I'll be gassed still. I don't care if it's just once to watch Sancho. Apparently, that's what it could be. Let's just reveal it. Here we go. Anyways, right to left. Right to left. What do we see? Okay, it's going to get to the first player in a sec. Uh, here we go. First player is coming up now. Who is... Oh, that's a... That's a moment. Oh, okay. Timmy and moments, David. That's actually a good start. That's actually a good start. That's a, I'm, I'm already happy with that pull there. I mean, he's probably not worth 85 rated squad. But he's still a good card. He's usable. Next one is... What's this? An inform? Inform... Inform mount. Okay, that's uh, a little bit questionable. He's like, yeah, no, I don't really want that. Number three, it's a one stop. Uh, sorry, not one stop. A team, a road to the final. Sorry, road to the knockouts. Rodrigo, road to the knockouts. Has he got a better card though? I feel like he's got a better card. I feel like I'm getting excited, but he's actually got a better card. But that's actually still a very good card. Actually, wasn't he an objective? That's a dub, right? That's a dub. And then it is a rule breaker. It's Trent rule breaker. You know what? You know what? That's actually a pretty solid pick, right? I feel like Rodrigo's the one to go for there. I don't know. David's pretty cheap. Rodrigo's a very nice looking card. All right. Well, I think we're going Rodrigo. He's worth about 290k. So, you know, I think we'll go with him. That'll be a nice pick. Let's choose him. And I guess we'll get into the next one. All right, shout out to my boy X Lost Mafia, a very, very good friend of mine. We've got another FS reunion player. We're going to probably start with it again because it was kind of exciting, actually. I, I don't like seeing the player pick straight away. I kind of get a bit bored. I'm not going to lie. Like, not a bit bored, but it's just like, oh, they're there. Do you know what I mean? It's cool to see it right to left. So let's just actually play reveal it again. Not start reveal, play reveal, and let's see what we get. All right, Mafia has now opened his player pick. So we're going to reveal it from right to left again. Just because it's a lot more fun. Instead of just seeing it straight away, I, li I like it. I like seeing it, you know, just appear every so often. All right, first one up is a team of the year moment. Is that going to be David again? It's actually Jonathan David again. It's actually Jonathan David again. All right, that's actually, it is a good card. He's not worth the most, but it is a good card. On to player number two. Uh, what's it going to be? Uh, Tonali. Was he an SBC or an object? I feel like he was an SBC and objective. He wasn't, was he actually? No. I mean, David's definitely the one to go with so far. 100%. Player number three in form. Is it going to be Mountain again? No, it's not. It's... Oh, it's Ismail Asar. Okay, Tadar Asar. All right. Player number four. It's going to be David so far. For me, I would choose... Oh, oh. Oh, my God. I knew that. He's got Tierney. <laughs> Mafia is an Arsenal fan. He is going to be absolutely over the moon with Tierney. He's 1 million percent taking Kieran Tierney. 1 million percent. That's a dub. That's a dub. He's an Arsenal fan. He'll be very happy with that. All right, shout out to the Mantino. He wants actually reveal as well. I mean, I feel like everyone likes the reveals because they don't want to see it straight away and they want to get a bit excited player by player. So let's get the image in front and let's get ready for him to open it up. Okay, so I'm going to have to look to the right. That's why I'm looking to the right is because I kind of mucked up this because it is literally right in front of me. I haven't actually looked at it though. So we are just going to reveal this like together. So I'm going to have to look to the right here. Is that, I think that's Gabriel Martinelli as the first one 
on his account for Tino, okay? Not the greatest start, not the best, not the worst. Player number two for the reveal. It is a road to the knockouts again. And gnarly, that's not the one you want to see for player number two. All right, player number three now. What are we going to see for these player picks? Anything good? It's an, is, that, is that a signature signing? Ooh, uh, signature signing Diaz. 76, I mean, he's good fodder at least. He's high rate. I mean, he probably is still usable, right? And now player number four, it is a team of the tournament, Anthony. Ooh, who would I take there? I actually don't know who I'd take there. Probably actually Anthony. I think Anthony would be very good off the bench. Um, I actually can look forward now, which is all right. I'd actually take probably Anthony, I think. I think he's the most usable one. Five-star skills as well. You could go Diaz if you want the rating, but usability-wise, I'd say probably for that one, Anthony. In my personal opinion, anyways, I, that's what I'd go for. All right, we're on now my RTG account. We're going to reveal it again. I, I, I would like to open them normally, but I just they're just not as fun to open normally. So let's just go for it. Let's reveal it. Let's do the image in front, and let's crack this open, and let's get into it. Okay, here we go. We're about to go from right to left again. Let's get to the first player and see who we're uh, starting with. Okay, first player is coming up now. It is... What is that? Oh, it's a one... Oh, oh, actually, that's actually not bad. He's, he's actually one of the only ones to watch it who's actually had an upgrade. Like, that's pretty solid. Upper Meccano, pretty solid. I wanted Sancho, though. Oh, this one is going to be a signature signing. Is that Gwendouzi? Oh, yes. That is Gwendouzi. What a W. What a dub. I'm 100% taking Gwendouzi so far. 100%. I'm happy with that. We've got rule breakers here. We've got rule breakers. Kulaveski. Don't really want him. I'm not going to lie. Um, okay. And then, last but not least, what card is it? It is... Oh, who is this? It's, it's Isaac. I mean, he's actually got a pretty good card, I'm pretty sure. It's 87, but there's no debate there. Where's my controller? Give me Gwen Doozy. I am very, very happy with that. That is a solid, solid dub. Both dubs on my account so far. All right. I believe this is like pick number four. Five or six like that or something like that for the video. I don't know. Anyways, let's get into it. Let's get the image in front. We're going for the reveal again. All right, here we go. Player one. Shout out to my man, Orlando. By the way, this is Orlando's account. Who have we got? Oh, my. That is an absolutely awful start. Can I just point out? 80 run rated Cliver. It can only be up from here, at least. It can literally only be up from here. It's going to be a road to the knockouts. Don't be Tenali. It's not Tenali. It's Rodrigo. That is already a good start. That's a good start. Rodrigo, player number two. That is solid. Player number three. Can we get anything good from player number three? It's going to be... Is that an inform again? Uh, it's Bastoni. Okay, well, at least Rodrigo's here. That's all I'm saying. That's like 250k. Like, player number four. Who's it going to be? It is... Is that Isaac again? Okay, well, there we go. Rodrigo. I mean, we can't actually complain at all. Rodrigo's a dub. I mean, we've already got him once. But, like, Rodrigo's actually sick. Like, he's worth, like, 250k. That is a dub. All right, shout out to my very good friend, Mr. Robbie Robster. He's got his player pick now. Let's crack it open and let's reveal it. All right, player number one is coming up. It's going to be an inform to kick it off. Bakayo Saka is an Arsenal fan as well. So it's not the worst start, actually, at all. 86 Saka. Okay, player number two. What do we see as player number two for these? It's, another... it's actually two Arsenal players. <laughs> He's actually an Arsenal fan. He's been given Saka and Martinelli to kick this off. Okay, player number three in the pick. Who is it going to be? It's going to be a... What's that? Once to watch, isn't it? Oh, my. That's terrible. That is... Uh, don't, don't even look at it. I don't even want to see it. I don't even want to see it. It's Cucurella. Player number four. Who is it going to be? Oh... Uh, nine out of ten. Moussa Dembele. Uh, I, that is actually... You know what? It's kind of good because he is an Arsenal fan, but that's probably one of the worst ones we've seen. But... Saka is there. He's an Arsenal fan. So it makes it a little bit better, I guess. All right. You guys know what's up next. Shout out to Muck Wars here. We've got another reveal. This is number like seven or eight. I'm not too sure how many we've opened. Let's see what he gets. All right. Here we go. Player number one is appearing. It's Martinelli showing up way too often for my liking. All right. Martinelli is the first player. It can only really realistically be up from there. Once again, I guess. At least it's like, you know, you're starting off slow, but then you're picking up the pace. Hopefully we're playing number two. Jonathan David. It's, got, it's gone from all right to better definitely usable can we go up again for player number three let's have a look what card is it going to be oh tierney oh it's a bit of a that's a 50 50 tierney and david that's actually a 50 50 number four player four can it be a big boy for player number four what do we see it's a wants to watch tamori wants to watch he's actually a beast in game i can't lie but he's only 82 rated 
Who would I take there? It's, it's actually quite a hard choice. Tierney or David are both pretty solid. David's very good if you want an attacker. Tierney's a solid left back. It's a hard choice. It's actually a pretty hard choice. I can't lie. I'd probably go maybe just Edward David, I guess, with the rating as well. You can use him. If you don't want to use him, you can use him more for fodder. All right, shout out to the man Bushler. We've got his one. We're going to reveal it. It's an Xbox one again. Let's see what he gets. All right, we're coming up to player number one for Bushler. We kick it off with a once to watch Cucurella. Oh, that is that is the bottom of the barrel. Like, there's literally no way you can't get better than that. I'm pretty sure. Like, even a Martinelli would be an improvement right now. Player number two is definitely an improvement. It's going to be Kieran Turning. That is like an, a monumental improvement to Cucurella. Okay, player number three is about to appear. Who do we see? Anything good in form? Oh my god, that's that's terrible. That's I don't even know how you pronounce his name, but that is absolutely terrible. Can player number four be a dub? Let's have a look. It's about to appear. It's going to be Musa Dem Ballet. Right, Tierney is the one there 100% to take. In my personal opinion, that is the only one I would take from there. All right, shout out to the man Callum. We're going to do a few normal ones now, I think, to end off the video. Hopefully, people are okay with that. We're going to go with some normal ones. So, instead of doing the reveal, you guys can see it straight away. But I, I do still think reveals are better. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. Anyways, let's crack it open. Please be a dub for the first non-revealed one. Right, what, what is this card? Oh, it's numbers up Rainer or David. They're the only two you want to be choosing from here. I actually don't know who I'd take. I think personally I would go David. I think that's the option to go with, but it's not my choice. I would probably go David. He wants Rainer, which is fair enough because Rainer can still get upgraded. So I actually don't blame him. That's not too bad. All right, shout out to the man FIFA Knight. We've got another Future Stars reunion player pick, please. I mean, I don't know what the best player is you can get. I think it's Vinicius Jr. I'm pretty sure. As long as they put Vinicius Jr.'s headliners in here, that would easily be the best. It's the choice between Rainer and David again. Uh, it's, it's just a 50-50. I mean, like I said, Rainer does get the upgrade, but David's very good right now. I mean, 94 pace, 90 shot, 88 dribbling. Like, it's quite a hard choice. I can't lie. Well, there we go then. That wraps it up. The best pull will probably be Rodrigo a couple of times. He was probably like the most expensive pull, I think. I mean, David was pretty solid. We saw him a fair few times. He's actually a pretty solid card, like very good in-game. And then also the Gwendouzi and my RTG was very good, in my opinion. Apart from that, we didn't sadly see any Vinicius Juniors or anything like that. But it wasn't the worst. I mean, I think most majority packs, or sorry, of player picks had some good players that are usable, at least, on the game. But yeah, anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you did enjoy the video and I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.